Hello guys, welcome again to my channel. So our today's video topic is integrating Excel export and import in Laravel. So while working in the real world application, sometimes you need to export your data to the Excel file or you need to import uh, data from the Excel file into the database. So let's see how we can done this. Now for this tutorial, I'm going to use this library called fast Excel. It's a nice library and under the hood, it's using spout library, which is fast and memory friendly. Now, um, I have installed the Laravel, fresh Laravel, open it in my editor. And this is my database. We will work on users table. So let's get started. I copy this command terminal new terminal and copy the command here uh, while package is installing let's define our routes route get Excel Excel controller index then route post import import then route get export and export in the index method i will call the blade file and on that blade file we create a simple html form where user can browse the file and uh, will give a link where user can export the file for this under the resources views i create the file called excel blade.php now in this file let's define the simple form it will has method post action will be our import route And as we are browsing file, we need to add this attribute. Then we require CSRF and input file. Input type file name, let's give it name as users. Then have one input button to submit the form value submit and let's have one anchor tag to export the data url export uh, i call it export users why users so for a, uh, as an example, I'm taking users table. We are going to export records from the user table and import record to the user table. And let's define message here. Once user is imported, we will display the success message. We 
have to create this controller php artisan make controller excel controller here as we are dealing with users table i am importing model here and we need to add the facade of our package here i can see this one now let's define our two methods uh, three methods index export and import so this is my first one then public function import request request and public function export so here is included model fasa index oh, let me correct the spelling import and export fine so here i am calling our view excel if i visit the route when we click on this export users one excel xls file should be downloaded which has the records containing our user so for that under the export method i will write the code return new fast excel then get the all user and download uh let me name it as users.xls x fine now to export the data we need some dummy entries in our users table for that mm, okay let me first stop this okay i'm going to use laravel inbuilt faker library to seed our users table for so for that i first enter into the tinker okay then app models user factory then let's create 50 dummy entries and create enter okay seems like entries are created let me refresh it yep we got the our 50 dummy entries now i click on export users my file is downloaded let's open it got it now i got the 50 entries into my exported excel file but here you can see there are few columns that are exported but in the real world you might want only two columns called name and email so you can export you can filter filter out those columns in the final exported file for that what i do is here i write callback function user and then i'm just returning let's say my column name is name and what are the column value email
user email. Now let's try again. Export users one. Here we go. Now we have only name and email column, and there are fifty entries. Simple enough. In the same way, let's say you want to export CSV file, so you just need to set the extension like this .csv, and you will get your Excel file, uh, CSV file. Sorry. Now let's see how to import uh, Excel sheet into the Laravel application. Now. I am adding one dummy entries called let us say John Doe. Email is John Example dot org. Now, in the import method, what I do is users equal to new fast Excel call the import method my file name request file users users is my input field name then function line return user first or create why first or create because while importing excel sheet into the laravel application we require the we require to avoid our duplicate entries so i add the checks on email if that email does not exist then only import it into database so for that i am using first or create email line of capital email because this is my column name heading then name dollar line of name add a semicolon here now let's try at first we are on 50 entries okay new entries should be inserted here choose file user one submit excel index oh, i think we made mistake in the route yeah index import the get method is not supported methods post yeah we can't access this directly Excel. Submit. We got the okay. We got stuck into the import. Why? Because we didn't return our control. So I am writing return redirect 
excel and it will return with success message users imported successfully we got our entry but let me uh, reimport it so that our control come to our excel route again submit users imported successfully and i am refreshing it i got the new entries so this is how we can ex import the excel file now it is about importing excel as x file now let's say you want to uh, import csv file so for csv file you can't import it directly like this uh, excel file in case of csv you first need to store your csv file on the server and then import it so for that let me revise the code here on this three line now you, what i am doing is i am storing the csv file un, under the public csv folder and then you need to pass the path of your csv file here and for that you need to create the symbolic link to your storage folder like this now when you try to import your csv file it will import it automatically to your laravel application so yeah that's it so it's all about importing and exporting excel file through your laravel application so i hope you understand the tutorial guys and if you like the tutorial please subscribe to my channel thanks for watching video have a nice day